Hi. I know that I've been neglecting you, but I'm back from Manhattan now and you have my undivided attention. Did you miss me? I have longed for the return of my favorite dame. Is that sustenance, yes, hopefully? Spinelli brain food, orange soda, barbecue chips. Oh, thank you. I've been consoling myself with long hours of hard work and I've eaten very little. <laughs> well, there you go. Do you want to know about my trip? Uh-huh. We went to two fashion shows and three after parties. Those were probably my favorite because they start so late, everybody gets lit and anything pretty much can and does happen. Oh, well, uh, I, I see. Who did you attend these festivities with? I went to the shows with Kate. Basic first assistant stuff. I had to sit behind her, take notes on what she liked and didn't like, pay attention to who she was talking to. It was a full-time job in itself, but Kate's got that schmoozing thing down to a science. Um, and the parties, who did you go to those with? Oh. I went with Fetty, only because his boyfriend was at a photo shoot in Nice, and the best part was I had Kate under almost constant sur surveillance. Well, actually, I'm confused. I thought you were against further investigation of the Glacier One. Well, I don't want to lose my job, and I don't want Kate to get fired, but you seem to think it's important to know why Kate's leaking her own layout, so so do I. I'm flattered by the confidence you have in my instincts. Oh, flattered enough to go with me? Uh, what, what does that invitation entail? I broke Kate's PDA. On purpose, of course. Oh. Don't worry, she's using her backup. But I was thinking that maybe her main one had something stored on this that might give us a clue. So I left it at Crimson. I didn't want to bring it here in case she would notice it was gone. So if you want to check it out, we have to go back to the office. I am most impressed with your quick thinking and gift for subterfuge. You know, if the fashion world loses its allure, you could be an intrepid private investigator. Spinelli, you say the nicest things to me. Let's go. Colossal waste of your time. Not true. I think perusing the Glacier One's PDA proved to be most helpful. But we didn't find anything. Yeah, which shows us that the Glacier One sequestered proof of her illegal activity in an alternate location. See, detection is all about the process of elimination. The seasoned professional knows not to expect conclusive evidence in the very first try. It's one of the things I like most about you. You never get discouraged. Uh, I have begged to differ. I am often thrown into the pit of despair, but it is most often you who leads me back into the light of hope and optimism. Uh, that is definitely not true. I am one of the most relentlessly cynical people that I know, but that was beautiful, Spinelli. I will take the compliment. I know you see the good in me. And when I'm with you, I believe in all that light and hope and optimism and stuff. <laughs> but I still have a job. Yes, Kate. It's on your desk, in perfect working condition. Yes, I asked Spinelli. No, I'm not with Spinelli right now. I I'm on three blocks away picking up your wrinkle cream. I'll be back soon. 